Man, we're going to go to our next Lord. phone call. Amen. You're live on the air. What's your prayer request, question, or comment for our guest? Hi. Um, I just had a, a prayer request. Um, on last week, I met with um, a couple of ladies, and we all prayed, and they prayed um, and touched and agreed with me for my deliverance um, just off of some life, some life situations and issues that I've been going through. And um, one of the things that I was kind of, you know, instructed to do was, like, talk to my mother about some past hurt, uh, sexual abuse that I went through. And today I'm actually going to take her to dinner and talk to her. Uh, but I'm I'm really starting to feel anxious and kind of doubting whether or not I should even necessarily bring those things up because I'm afraid of how she would um, respond to me. So I just want prayer that God will uh, give me peace and, and give me the right words and that she will be open um, to receive what I have to say so that that way full healing can take place for me. Well, amen. Well, woman of God, it looks like you're on the right track. Let me tell you something. When you release it, that's going to be released for you. See, the enemy wants to discourage you and not talking about it. But let me tell you something. I myself dealt with the same thing. But in order for me to be totally free, I had to talk to my mother and my father and let them know what was going on. That gave me release because as long as I held it, I kind of blamed them for what has for what happened. And so in a sense, it's kind of like this has happened to me, but mom, where were you? Right. So in order to get your release and, or, and, and then too, not just your, but to release her from that guilt that she, you know, when I say guilt, the guilt that she wasn't there for you, you have to speak and let her know what happened. Mm -hmm. You know, yes, so be confident in what God has given you. Everything is well. Everything is going to work out. God's got it. Don't worry about what to say. God's going to give you what to say. Yes, and don't, Thank and, you. And don't hold back any emotion. Let your tears come forward because that's you telling, you know, showing, exposing your heart. You got to let your heart speak. And I Not just words, but let your heart speak. And I want to tell you this to reveal this to you. Your mother, as you confess to her, she's going to confess some things to you about some things that happened to her as well. Yes, ma'am. Oh my God. Well, thank you thank so you. much for calling in to Inspired Overflow. Amen, amen. We're going to go back. We're going to go to our phone lines. We're just going to continue to let um, our callers uh, speak to our guests. Um, we're going to just minister to them um, until the end of the show. Don't forget, though, in case we don't have a chance to announce this again, the Restoring the Voice, the Prophetic Conference, re Prophetic Revival, March the 20th through the 22nd. Come meet Prophet, Prophet Green in person and see uh, his lovely wife, Prophetess Margaret, Margaret Green, March March 20th through the 22nd at 7 p.m. at Highway of Holiness Church in Alton, Illinois. Okay, let's go to our phone lines. Thank you so much for holding. What's your prayer request, comment, or question? Good afternoon. I was calling for a prayer request for my son. He is in the Marines, and he was just deployed to Afghanistan. And I'm just asking a prayer for God to just watch over him and his company and to just bring him home safely in one piece. Amen. Well, we're going to touch and agree right now. Father, in the name of Jesus, Lord, you heard her request already. She made it known, Father. God, I pray right now that you remove the fear or intimidation, God. Hallelujah for her son. Oh, yeah, there they are. See, I know. There it is. Hallelujah. God said, I'm breaking it off of you. I'm breaking it off of you. I'm breaking it off of you. Let me take it away from you. Take up on my yoke. Father, we rebuke that spirit that's trying to infiltrate and go into her mind and make her feel and think different ways, Father. In the mighty name of Jesus, we thank you right now for a good report. Yes, yes. For her son returning back safely, Father. Yes. In the mighty name of Jesus, yes. Lord, we thank you right now. Yes. You are everywhere at the same time. Yes. Send your angels. Dispatch them right now. Everywhere that he goes. Yes. In the mighty name of Jesus, that she will come back with a report, Father, a testimony of what you did for her this day now father confirm it in her spirit let her not even think about it tomorrow in thank the mighty you. name of jesus it's already done in jesus name jesus thank god and amen 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 god bless you we're gonna go to our next uh caller you're live on the inspired overflow radio show amen you're live on the inspired overflow radio show hello yes you're live on the air Hi, um, can I have prayer uh, this afternoon? Uh, just prayer for God's continued uh, strength and wisdom as 
as our church or in transition, I also want that spiritual transition to grow all the more and just be in the will of God for the gifts in my life and just what he would have me to do. Amen. Okay. Woman of God, sounds like to me you're still in search of purpose. God needs to reveal exactly why you were created. Am I telling the truth about who I'm talking to? Pardon me? Uh, as far as your purpose, God's trying to, he, you're still in search of what it, why God created it, like the purpose. You're seeking God for purpose. Well, yeah, and, um, you know, I know God had given me this vision in 2005, you know, what to do for his women, and it's like I kind of started on it, but it's like a set. I don't want to say a setback, but just like a hold on. So in the meantime, until God continue to move those things or bring the right people, it, you know, to help me with this vision to what I'm to do, you know. Amen. So it sounds like to me then the prayers that you are praying now should be send the right people. Yeah. Send send what I need, Father, because yeah. that's going to encourage you. Right now you feel like you're not doing enough. But God said, as you pray unto me and ask, we have not because we ask not. When you start to open your mouth and ask God, heaven is going to move on your behalf. You continue to live right and you continue to encourage people. I would say that if I were you, I would go on a fast uh, concerning my purpose and for God to send the right person uh, in my life. And I believe God is going to do that. Now, listen here. It's going to take some faith from what I'm about to tell you. Uh, God just told me that when you start to pray and believe and trust in him before the year is out, he's going to connect you with somebody that's going to give you the next next uh, part of your vision. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. <laughs> you need Hallelujah. to say amen I to that. I was, I was in prayer with God um, yesterday and just really in prayer and praise. And uh, we began to uh, you know, the spirit began to talk with me about fasting. Yeah. And I was saying, God, well, you know, you know, I don't I don't mind doing the fast. Well, you want me to do a Daniel fast? And, and, you know, exactly what am I, you know, doing this fast? Am I looking Amen. To, amen. To amen. Existing? What, what am I supposed to be putting myself out there? Okay, God, what? Amen. Amen. Well, my sister, you continue to amen to adhere and listen to the to the voice of the Lord. Amen. amen. I want to thank Prophet Green. I want to thank Prophetess Margaret Green for blessing us on the Inspired amen. Overflow radio show. Don't forget, y'all, March 20th through the 22nd at Highway of Holiness Church at 7 p.m. You can see the Prophet Miracle wheelchair preacher there. Prophetess Green, is there another way that they can connect with Prophet uh, Green, too? Yes. You can also visit us on our website at www. The wheel. I'm sorry, www.wheelchairmiracle.com, or you can visit us on Facebook as well. Amen. Well, Inspired Overflow, know that we love you, but God loves you more. Amen. Until next week, be blessed. Be blessed. Be blessed. Walk in the overflow. Amen.